another day another video and today is a really 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 great day for the shinobi striking community recently bandai released a trailer for naruto to baruto shinobi striker season 5 and i'm super excited to tell you guys about it now i'm pretty sure you have already watched um like pretty much all like the big youtubers like videos and stuff getting every little piece of information you could out of this and that's all right that's cool but if you're watching my video right now i basically just want to give you a couple predictions and stuff that i think will happen in the upcoming season five for this game now i'm going to make it short and quick so i won't waste any of you guys' time so let's get let's get right into it starting off with my first prediction of what i think will happen in this game is the maps now if you've seen in the trailer basically they showed the hidden leaf map the one without the pitfalls and all that kind of stuff basically um they added a whole bunch of buildings like more buildings and stuff they changed the looks and they also added snow which was pretty cool um now what i think will happen is they'll do that to the rest of the maps now they can't just do it to one map and call it a day because i'm pretty sure since they said they've been listening to us we will not be satisfied me personally i wouldn't be satisfied and i honestly think that they'll do that with the rest of the maps hopefully that's the case if not i don't even i wouldn't even know what to say moving on to the second prediction it has to do with the characters now basically they're going to give us five characters for this season like they did with the past seasons that we've gotten and i'm not really disappointed by that i wasn't really expecting more but here we are anyways yeah now what i'm thinking is now what i'm thinking they'll do for this season is give us a character from each village now why do i think that because the theme of the season is legacy now i'm thinking that like they'll give us some type of baruto character or something like that like someone in the newer generation if they don't i'm honestly thinking that they'll just give us some popular character from like each village maybe even the same character but like a different transformation like everybody's saying barry on Nar naruto that could happen that could definitely happen and i wouldn't be surprised if we get barry on naruto in this new season and y'all i know i said i was moving on from the maps but i just want to add one more thing honestly if they were to add like a new map or two i feel like they should add something like the hidden miss uh, the hidden mist is my favorite village if y'all didn't know that basically i feel like they should add the hidden mist or a different version of a village map that they already added like the, the hidden sand or like the hidden cloud because if you've been playing this game long enough you know that those two maps are honestly the worst when it comes to pitfalls and getting knocked into the pit and all that kind of stuff it is so bad honestly like you could you can ask any player that's been playing this game long enough they will they'll tell you the same thing now moving on to the next thing it has to do with fighting styles or like mechanics and all that kind of stuff as you've seen in the trailer when they were displaying the new like revamp or like renovation to the hidden leaf map they also showed a new type of chakra jump now basically what the chakra jump is is instead of going like forward you jump straight up onto like a building or something like that which i think is pretty cool and i'm glad they're actually paying attention to like the mechanics and all that kind of stuff instead of just adding characters now my thing is i feel like they should do something with like the fighting styles and all that kind of stuff what do i mean by that now basically i mean this okay for the longest time you could go around the community asking people this by the way we've always wanted like fist for like defense types or like fist for healers like a fist fighting style for any class is perfect because you see that with the cast characters they should definitely follow suit and give us a fighting style or like a fist fighting style for the other classes as well because honestly i think that would freshen up the game so much and make it so much better than it is right now and i understand they're listening to us and all that kind of stuff but this season honestly is like the perfect time because i'm pretty sure that it's supposed to be the fifth anniversary this year so this is like the perfect chance for them to add all the stuff that we've been asking for now moving on to the last and final thing i want to talk about in this video and i cannot stress this enough we definitely need more vr missions or something like that because 
if you've been playing this game since its release or you've been playing it for like a year or two years even like a month you would definitely be finished with the vr missions by now and just playing ninja world league red and white battle etc is not enough for you i'm pretty sure it isn't and going back and playing those vr missions and doing the same old thing isn't enough for you either no it's definitely not enough for me and so what i'm thinking is they should add some type of story mode or even a like new vr missions anything like that would make me satisfied or make a lot of us satisfied in this community because it is such a talked about thing not as much as the other things but it's definitely talked about and i feel like they should add that stuff and that's probably going to do it for the video if you liked my predictions and my ideas for this season go ahead and drop down a like on the video because it really helps me out and all that kind of stuff and leave down in the comments your predictions and your ideas that you want to see in this game and yeah peace out y'all y'all have a nice day morning night whatever it is and see you later